Hello, everybody. Hang on, let me turn this up a little bit. This is Yoko's Anime Reactions, and this is going to be my review for Is It Wrong to Try and Pick Up Girls in the Dungeon? Episode 8. And um, I'm starting to think that that guy who toyed with the Minotaur last episode uh, did so under Freya's orders, possibly, to try and get Belle to interact with it. And I assume that's the case. And later on, uh, he finishes his training with eyes. Um, I don't know how well he improved, but I think it went decently well. He wasn't horrible at it. Then again, I don't know that sort of thing. And um, he and Lily go down in the dungeon, you know, to test out his new... Uh, new skills, I'm assuming. Or rather, his new technique, I should say, in when it comes to swordsmanship. And, uh, while they're down there, they run into that very same Minotaur. It causes a lot of damage to both Belle and Lily, and he has to tell Lily, go, while he's trying to hold it off, because he wants to give her a chance to escape. She very reluctantly leaves, but she ends up running into Eyes and her group when they are, da you know, down on the same floor. And they actually ran into a couple of pe a few people who ended up running into that same Minotaur and somehow barely survived <laughs> their encounter. And by the time they get there, he's already fighting it very hard, and when she tries to step in to fight it on his behalf, he doesn't let her. He's tired of getting rescued by her, and I don't blame him. He just wants to be able to strong enough to be able to fight alongside her if he needs to. And he can't do that if he's constantly getting rescued by her, because he can't handle the opponents that she goes up against. So... Um... Whew. Uh... While he's fighting the thing, uh, he ends up breaking the other knife. Not the one that Hephaestus made him. It was the other one. And somehow, he ends up killing it. But he ends up unconscious on his feet. And apparently all his skills are level S, which I have no clue how, what, how good that is or whatever. Is it like on Eyes' level? Is it still not quite there yet? What, what is it? Can somebody explain that to me, please? But, yeah, he's alive, obviously, but he needs to get his injuries taken care of before he can do anything else. And if this was all Freya's idea, like, what? That lady's messed up. She's very messed up. She might be a goddess, but she's messed up. And so, yeah, I think he's finally earned the respect of the rest of Eyes' party, possibly. Maybe. At the very least, he's got Eyes' respect. If not, the lady who can do the healing and the magic as well. I'm assuming he's got her respect as well. I don't know. Anyway, um... Obviously, Hestia is relieved that Belle is okay because, you know, she loves him. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That's gonna be awkward in future seasons. As for if I'm gonna pick up season two, I will at some point. I just don't know when. Maybe by the maybe when the the year starts up again, maybe when the year starts up again and the kids go back to school, I might pick it up. Though, by the time they go back to school, I'm gonna be a recording machine doing nothing but recording uh the reactions when they're at school and they're recording the reviews and uploading videos when they're not in school, is what I'm gonna be doing. And if there comes a day where I am gonna be off the next day from work. I don't care. I'll be staying up that night to go and get stuff done because, yeah, I'm going to be, I need to get this stuff done. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will try and get the rest of the reviews recorded today for the show and I will see you all next time.